today's video, let's get ready for the holiday season with 10 things you should expect to see from Clash of Clans in the December update. What's going on, my friends? My name is Joe, and December is a really big month in Clash of Clans. We got the Clash World Championships happening in a few days, as well as an update right around the corner. And let's not forget about those massive special offers that are gonna populate in Clash of Clans around the holiday season. So in today's video, we're gonna talk about 10 things that you should expect to see in Clash of Clans in the month of December. <laughs> Item number one on our list, we have the Jolly Warden skin, available in the December 2021 Gold Pass. Now, most of you probably already know about this at this point. What's really interesting about that skin is that it does resemble the Jolly King skin, but I'm sure most of you guys are more interested in what's coming in the update and when is that going to happen. Well, when we refer over to the Clash of Clans Wikipedia page for version update history, we can normally see all the trends and patterns patterns on when Clash of Clans likes to release certain things. Let me give you an example of this. So I think it's very safe to assume that Clash of Clans is more than likely going to release a Siege Machine in the next update in December. So this information is very important to most of you guys that are Town Hall 13 and above because you need to save your resources for the possible upgrade of your Siege Machine workshop. But some of you guys have been speculating about the possibility of a brand new troop or a brand new spell. And I don't really think that that's necessarily the case in this next update because when we look at this information We could pretty much predetermine if Clash of Clans is going to release a brand new item within the troops or spells department, I'm taking bets on it possibly being a Dark Elixir spell. Now, number four on our list is more than likely the least popular of new additions in Clash of Clans in the Super Troops. But what's really interesting about this information is that Super Troops have a very clear line of new additions in Clash of Clans. Now, 2021 was a little bit different because in April's update, we saw the release of Town Hall 14. There was not a brand new Super Troop released in that update. So I think at this point, it's very safe to assume that in December of 2021, we're gonna more than likely see either one or two new super troops added to Clash of Clans, unless they release Town Hall 15. I don't think that's necessarily the case because that leads us into number five on our list. And that's the fact that Town Hall 14 is not complete when it comes to their upgrades. When we jump over into the village editor, you will see that Town Hall 14 still has 125 pieces of wall that have not been released for upgrade. So in the next update, could we see these pieces of wall released for us to finish Town Hall 14 or are they just going to give us 50 or 100 like they've done in past releases? Now, when can we expect this update? will more than likely see this update released around December 13th or the 14th. That way they can get things right before the holidays. All right, so that was my speculation for the update. What about free items as well as stuff that you might have to buy? Well, based on information in the past, we can always assume that there's going to be a brand new Christmas tree. Now, I did scour the internet and I did find this image right here. Nothing has been confirmed by Supercell, so it's more than likely fake. 
Now, don't forget that last year we also got a free obstacle in the season pass with the Logmas tree in celebration of the log launcher's release. Last year, we also saw the addition of a temporary troop in the Ice Wizard and a temporary spell in the Santa's Surprise. So could we see the return of both of those items in 2021 for a temporary time frame and a special event? And since we're on the topic of special events, don't forget that last year we had the addition of the Winter Challenge where we got that free shovel of obstacles to move our Christmas trees. That's kind of why they did that. And then they also included a new winter scenery last year, which was available for in-game purchase at $6.99. So could we see a brand new winter scenery coming to Clash of Clans in December? I think the possibility is pretty high considering we just saw a Halloween scenery a few months ago. Moving into number 10, do not forget the trader deals. There was a lot of good stuff last year. Now the trader deals will start around the middle of the month around December 20th like last year and last but not least for my big spenders out there do not forget that there are going to be more than likely some massive deals coming to Clash of Clans in regard to Christmas holiday last year we saw five different deals with a lot of resources and magic items that were available that can help you speed up the progress of your base especially if you're a Town Hall 14 trying to max out before the next new Town Hall level. What'd you guys think? Let me know down in the comments below what I missed in this list for expectations for the December update and things to come in this month. If you enjoyed today's content, make sure to leave a like on the video, subscribe if you have not done so already, and we will see you in the next video.